Hello students, welcome to the channel Top Gate. Today we will discuss uh, one more PDA question that is to design a PDA for the language L is equal to A to the power N, B to the power 2N. Now this is uh, uh, a very commonly asked questions in uh, university exams as well as uh, quite often they have asked this question in the gate exam as well. So we will discuss this question and uh, let us start with this one that is uh, we have to design a PDA for the language L is equal to A to the power N, B to the power 2N okay that is B should be put twice as A okay. So if A is 2 then B should be 4 okay so we have to design a PDA for this one okay. So uh, suppose we take the value of N is equal to 2 then the string we will be getting is a a b b b b. So, we should design a PDA that should accept all these things ok. If we take the value of n is equal to 1 we will get a b b ok. So, I will design a PDA for this one and then finally after designing I will check it with the wrong string also that uh, it should the wrong string should not be accepted with my in, in my machine ok. So, I will take an input tape here ok input tape we have this a a and followed by four b's and then epsilon ok. Currently the pointer is pointing on to the first a ok. Now the logic that we have in this one is uh, I mean I can have several logics so I will um, uh, design the PDA with two logics ok. Uh, the first logic is what I will do F first a I will get I will simply push it into the stack second a I will get I will again push it. So, any number of a's I am getting I will push it. Now, I know that the b is twice as equal to a ok. So, what I will do two a's are pushed in I will get the first b after this a I will bypass it ok and then again I can get the second b I will pop one a third b I will bypass fourth b I will pop one more a. So, for two b's I am popping one a fine fine. So, first b is bypassed second b pop one a third b bypass fourth b pop one more a in that way b will be put equal to a this is the first logic. Now, second logic we know that b is twice as equal to a. So, what I will do instead of pushing one a I will push two a's for this one that is I will get the first a I will push two a's I will get the second a I will push two a's. So, in this way I can have four a's in the stack however I have read only two a's in the input string ok. But in the stack I have 4 a's fine. So, now 4 a's I have and technically I know that there will be 4 b's also. So, every b for every b I will pop 1 a. So, I will work with those uh, both the logics ok. So, with the first logic that is we will bypass this first b and for second b we will pop 1 a. So, uh, with this logic I will tell you fine. So, currently initial state is q naught and the first day comes. First day comes what I will do a elementary process is a I will make a stack here we have z naught here fine. So, elementary process is a the top stack element is z naught we sim simply push it. So, I will write a z naught fine. So, this a will go here and the pointer will come on to the second day. Now, for second day again I will take a, uh, this uh, transition that is elementary process is a the top stack element is a we simply push it. So, this will be pushed in and the pointer will come on to the first B ok. Now, what, what I said as soon as I get the first B we simply have to bypass it we do not have to do anything. Second B I will pop one A ok. So, I will take a move for the first B ok. So, B elementary process is B the top stack element is A we simply skip it bypass it ok. So, I will write uh, I will write simply a here ok. So, nothing is done to the stack and we have reached on to a new state q1 and at q1 this pointer will now move on to the next b ok. We will now move on to the next b I will just make the stack here it will hamper otherwise ok. So, it is z0 a and a. Now, we have moved on to the first second b. Now, second b what I need to do? Second B, I need to pop one A for the second B. Okay, so from here I'll take a move for the second B. That is, elementary process is B. The top stack element is A. We simply pop it. Okay, so this A will be popped, and the pointer will now move on to the third B. Okay, and we have reached on Q2 now. 
fine now third b again i need to skip it fourth b again i will be i will be popping one more a so third d i third b, third b i need to skip so what i'll do i'll simply come to this q1 again that is element process is b the top stack element is a and what do we do we simply bypass it that is it will be a only and we are again on q1 and the pointer will now come on to this b okay now it is on this fourth b now fourth b again the elementary process is b the top stack element is a what it is saying it is saying that we have to pop it out okay so i'll pop it out and the pointer will now move on to this epsilon epsilon means the string is now complete and we are at q2 so this cycle will work for all the b's so one b will be skipped second b one a popped out third b skipped fourth b one a will be popped out so this will the cycle will work for all the b's fine now we are point at epsilon so i'll take a move for epsilon epsilon the top stack element is z naught and what do we do do nothing with the stack stack simply skip it reach on to some final state and we are done so this is with the first logic okay now let's check it whether it is working uh, with this logic or not uh, i mean it is working for the correct string if i take a wrong string suppose okay suppose i take a wrong string what is the wrong string suppose i take a a b b okay two a's and two b's so technically this should not work fine so if it is working then, then this solution is wrong it should not work because we have made this pdf for this particular string for this particular language and this particular string is not following this language okay so for this string this pda should not work if it is working this solution is absolutely wrong fine now i'll check it i'll make a stack here and i will check it what do we have in stack we have z naught that is now we have a a b b element to process is a the top stack element is z naught i'll take this move element to process is a top stack element is z naught simply push it we'll push it the pointer will now point to this first day now second day now okay now the elementary process is a top stack element is a a comma a do push it will be pushed and pointer will now come on to the first b now first b what does it say it is saying the elementary process is b top stack element is a do nothing skip it okay so i will simply skip it and i'll move on to the second b now i'm at q1 at q0 what is it saying it is saying that elementary process is b top stack element is a you need to pop out so here is epsilon what i'll do i'll simply pop this out and it will move on to the epsilon now and we are at q2 now at q2 what i need the elementary process is epsilon the top stack element is a now we don't have move for this one that is at q2 we have epsilon comma z naught that is if in stack there is only z naught then we can process but since here is one a so we cannot process this so we'll stuck somewhere here and will not be able to move on to the final state therefore this string will not getting is not getting accepted in this particular machine so our whatever we have designed for this language this is working and is correct now fine now let's take the second approach the second approach is first a comes push two a's for this one okay so i'll make another stack here for the second one now okay the second approach that is the pointer is here i'll make it here okay and i'll make a stack here the top stack element is z naught now what do we do as soon as we get the first a we don't push one a we will push two a's okay so i'll take it q naught and take a self loop and the elementary process is a the top stack element is z naught what do we do we have to push two elements so i will push two elements a a z naught okay it is just to show here uh, usually we show only two elements on top but it is uh, here we are showing that we are pushing two elements for a single a that's why i have shown this two a's okay so it will be like this a a okay and the pointer will now come on to this a second day again now again second day comes this transition will not work i'll again take a second move that is elementary process is a top stack element is a and what do we do again for this a we have to, to push two a's so it will be a a okay and this a a okay so this two a's will come here now four is i've shown that means two a's two a's okay it is just a way of representation nothing else fine uh, so a a and a so now four a's in the stack and the pointer will now come on to 
this b first b okay and now i'll take a move for b now what do i have to do i simply have to for every b i need to simply pop one a so this transition will work for all the a's any number of a's are there it will work for all the a's right now as soon as we get the first b so for the first b element to process is b the top stack element is a and what do we do we simply have to pop one a and reach on to some state that is q1 this will work for the first b the first b one a will be popped out and the pointer will now move on to this b here we have several b so what i'll do i'll simply take a self loop and here i write the same thing that is b elementary process is b the top stack element is a we simply pop out so all the a's will be popped so for this b this a popped out pointer will move on third one for third one this will be popped out and pointer will move on the fourth one this will be popped out and the pointer will now move on to epsilon okay string is complete so this self loop will work for all the b's so all the b's all the a's will be popped out and what is left z not is left and the pointer is pointing to epsilon so i'll take a move for epsilon epsilon the top stack element is z not and what do we do simply skip it go to some final state and we are done okay so this will also work this will also work so both are the same solutions but with a different logic okay so if you have some other logic you can give your own logic in the comment section okay thank you so much